Um, this is Edison. He's off camera. Edison, come. Come here, Edison. So, Edison's also got very long hair, so this will be also helpful for dogs who, who might have longer hair. All right, so Edison is 37 pounds. He wears a medium in the Wag Welly boot. And, um, you know, getting a dog used to wearing boots is definitely a process. Um, first time he put them on, he didn't know what to make of them. And... Um, proceeded to dance around in a very strange and funny way. Um, but as he realized he could walk in them, that nothing was gonna happen to him, uh, he got quite used to them. And now we'll wear them without a problem. Okay, so what I did is I opened the slit and I slid it on there and then I used my finger on the back to kind of press down the pad, his pad, his carpal pad, down into the, the heel of the boot. And so now it's in there very securely. Whoop, 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 whoop. And um, hold on, hold on, one sec. And then I'm gonna tighten it. There we go. All right, there you got one on, bud. All right, so that is and he's still he's probably going to walk a little funny usually um until they have all four boots on um, they may not even put the paw down uh, so we're going to try to put all four on and we will uh see how he does he's he's gotten pretty used to them so he's not gonna probably act as funny as he used to Here, boo -boo. All right, this is the second paw. So once again, I open it up and I kind of squeeze his, his uh, big toe and his pinky toe kind of together to slide into the slit. And then once I have, make sure there's no toes, no uh, nails coming out, I use my finger in the back again, push the pad down into the, uh, bed of the boot and then it's in pretty secure and I tighten the dog. Now he's got two on and we'll do the third one. <laughs> What do you think, Edison? You will be very happy because the salt is really starting to bother his feet. So he was having trouble this morning when we were outside. And uh, I don't always put them on, but when I, after a few days of it, the pads get really sensitive. And once they're dry and open, I think they really start to hurt. The back paws are typically easier than the front ones because there's no dew claw. So that makes them much easier to go on. But alright, and then last but not least. start to do it with a, my eyes closed. Once again, I use my finger to push the back of the paw in. I can almost do it just by touch. And then I tighten. All right, let's see you, Edison. And then we have, we're ready to go. All right. <laughs> ready to go? <laughs> well, he still has a little funny walk, but he'll get used to it once we get outside. You ready to go? Bye.
release. 